I'm so excited today to demo our newest treatment, which is the Greenwich Secret with Topical Sculptra. So you guys all know how amazing the Greenwich Secret is, which is basically a machine that uses microneedling with radio frequency to increase collagen and therefore helping with pore size, fine lines, crepiness, even dispigmentation. Um, it's really been an amazing treatment. We've been doing it for over about a year, year and a half, and it's one of the favorite treatments here at Nichols MD. So now imagine changing those results, which are already great, and making them even better. And that's where topical sculpture comes in. So topical sculpture with microneedling or with Greenwich Secret basically is using assisted delivery of topical products to get increased results. And this has been started to be used all over with PRP, which many of you are familiar with for treatment of you know wrinkles and everything with microneedling or with laser, also with the scalp in terms of hair growth. We're also using vitamin C topically on the skin right after a laser treatment or a Greenwich Secret or microneedling treatment. And the reason is because as you're opening up those little temporary micro channels with the device, then those topical ingredients can get deep into the skin, thereby creating um, you know, better results. So when you're using topical sculpture, we're familiar with sculpture or PLLA as something that you inject in order to get increased collagen and volume. And that's been used for years. It is literally one of my favorite treatments. It's sometimes put in the filler category because it increases you know, that volume of, that people lose over age. But the first thing that people notice with sculpture treatments injected is of course improvement in their skin quality, which lasts a long time. So now we're taking that, diluting the sculpture so that it can go into those micro channels directly after, and that's what you're gonna see in this demonstration, the treatments with the Greenwich Secret. And really we're seeing um, amazing results, improved healing, so um, less downtime we're seeing with the topical application of the sculpture also. The treatments are done um, every two months for a series of three treatments. And then we wait another two months or so after the third treatment to see the final results. And at that point, we'll decide whether we do any more treatments. But for most people, three treatments is enough and those results can last for a couple of years, which is amazing in terms of longevity. So super excited about this new treatment. We're gonna demo it right now so that you can all see what's, what we're doing today. And we have our beautiful patient here. I mean, how have, have you had this treatment before, even just the Greenwich Secret alone? No. No, no. So this is great. We're having a patient who's never had these treatments before, and then we'll dip, video it today, and then we'll see some after results um, after we finish with these treatments. So now we're gonna begin the treatment of the Greenwich Secret with Topical Sculpture. So with our patient, Grace, today, we're gonna be treating the full face. Now, of course, this is a treatment that we use often on the face and the neck, the chest, scars. It's amazing for stretch marks. Greenwich Secret alone is my go-to for stretch mark improvement, but when you pair it with the topical sculpture, the results are incredible. So this is um, definitely gonna be a, a game changer type of treatment. So Grace has already had numbing cream applied for an hour prior to her treatment. Most of our patients these days are uh, getting our numbing cream from us, applying it at home about an hour, hour and a half prior to their treatment, driving here and then starting the treatment. And by doing that, you're really only in the office for the treatment for about a half an hour, if that. So it's a very quick treatment. And what's so great about it is even Greenwich Secret alone, the downtime, and for those of you who've already had the Greenwich Secret, of course I have many times, um, the downtime is literally almost negligible. And that's something that we can't say about most of our treatments. Um, I tell patients that they can literally go out to dinner um, the next day and most people wouldn't really even know. You're a little pink that first day. And after that, you're just a little sandpapery for a few days. Same with the topical sculpture with the Greenwich Secret. In fact, what we're seeing in these initial, um, and what they saw in the studies and these um, initial treatments is that you actually can have even less downtime, even faster healing time. Um, so that's typical of, of treatments that we use with PRP on top of them. And now we're seeing that with the topical sculpture also. So you're getting increased results and less downtime. I mean, what could be better than that? All right, Grace, are you ready? We're gonna start the treatment. And we're gonna start the treatment with the forehead and just go around. It's not many passes at all. And then we apply the topical sculpture after the treatment and we let it penetrate. So you'll see that too. All right, here we go. So we start with the forehead. 
And like I said, it's a very quick treatment. With the numbing cream, most patients feel little, if any, discomfort. Cassandra, you've had the Greenwich Secret too, I right? I have. I love the Greenwich Secret. I have done it with the numbing cream before, which definitely helps. Um, it's really great. I have a lot of acne scarring and I have really big pores, so it has really helped diminish my pores as well as improve my acne scarring. Um, you can do it right through the summer, which is really what I love most about it. As Of course, wear your sunscreen, wear a hat, and stay out of the sun as much as possible, pre and post treatment as well. Um, but it's a great treatment. Yeah, and I'll tell you, I'm so glad you brought up mm -hmm. the acne scarring, which gosh, not only you, but um, half of America or more suffer mm -hmm. from. And with the topical sculpture, they're seeing better results than even with the Granite Secret alone, especially with um, scarring. Mm -hmm. So, because you're getting that collagen right. building from the sculpture, which kind of helps to fill those deeper, divoted scars better. So, you know, I think this is gonna be really um, promising for, that, for that indication also. People often ask, you know, is this good for, um, you know, discoloration, dark marks, um, melasma, which is a condition where you can, where women get discoloration on the face. I am one of those women. Um, and it's a very frustrating condition. This Granite Secret actually does help with those conditions, even though you're thinking, oh, okay, it's not really um, something that you would think of, like you would think of a laser or something taking off brown spots, but it can help with overall tone and evenness. So it is something that you can get a benefit from, a brightening from also in those in those conditions. All right, Grace, we're gonna have you turn here. And now we're moving, to, you'll see me changing some of the settings. And basically what I'm working on changing is depth. So depth of how these micro needles go into the skin. Um, and basically, if you wanna kind of zoom in, when I uh, hit, hit the um, button, you can kind of see those micro needles, that's what's going into the skin. So of course, on areas like the forehead where the skin is much thinner, we use a very um, a smaller depth. And then we go deeper, of course, on areas like this, um, the um, cheek. If we had something where we were talking about something like scarring, which is kind of thick and we need to get through, stretch marks, then of course we go even deeper. And that's the versatility of the Granite Secret. We literally can just change with our finger the depths that we want. So you're getting a very customized treatment. Grace is doing really great. I love it for um, also, even though today we're just for demonstration purposes, we're just um, treating Grace's cheek, uh, her face. It's really great for things like crepiness or lines on the neck, which um, if any of you saw me on the Today Show, I let you know that last year and this year <laughs> is the year of the neck. <laughs> um, so it's terrific for that. Again, really great because of course you can, on the neck skin, which tends to be a little thinner, you can change your depths of the needles and, and customize it for the patient. How are you doing, Grace? Doing good. Good. <laughs> We're almost halfway through. As you guys can see, this is such a quick, quick and easy treatment. And why don't you, um, Cassandra, sure. explain the topical sculpture over there and what we're gonna do with it. Sure, so sculpture is diluted um, in order to really give a great benefit to um, the face. It's usually used for injections, but the application of it topically is just gonna help to further build collagen. It can be used in stretch marks. It can also be used on um, scarring, C-section scars, regular scars from any sort of trauma. Um, and the addition of it with the microneedling and with the radio frequency really helps to penetrate on a deeper level of the skin to build the collagen from the from a deeper level up. Um, so over time and over a few sessions, it really helps to rejuvenate the skin, lift and tighten, as well as improve acne scarring. And a um, great point that you made in terms of, so when we talk about dilution, we don't mean diluting the power of uh, medication or mm -hmm. topical. What we mean is we use um, sterile water in the dilution or normal saline sometimes, depending upon what we're doing in order to make it um, diffuse and thinner so that it can get down into those micro channels as opposed to when we're injecting it um, in the skin for volume enhancement. So again, um, it's such a versatile product. Sculpture is literally my favorite, um, but that's when we're talking about, when we're talking about diluting, we mean making it kind of a smaller particle so that it really gets into those micro channels. All right, Grace, we are almost done. We're gonna work on this side of the cheek. You're doing great. 
you, Cassandra. Great explanation of that. Thank you. Thank you. And in terms of what to expect after, like I said, I mean, this is really one of the fewest um, treatments in terms of like having the fewest uh, days of downtime, if, if any, really. And even that downtime is very um, manageable and easy. This is not something where you have to take off work or anything like that um, post-treatment. So it's really great. Yeah, and that's the best part about the addition of the sculpture is that even if you did exhibit any redness a little bit after treatment, the sculpture really helps to speed up the downtime and the recovery time, so you're virtually left with no downtime. And I, I'm really excited to see, although it's a three treatment protocol, and like I said, those, those three treatments are separated by about two months. We are, in about a week or so, going to give you guys some after photos of Grace, because I want you to see how even after one treatment, we're going to see some nice improvement in our skin quality. Um, pore size, which I think is an issue for Grace. And I also want to even see if there's any improvement here in the little brown spots, the sun damage over here, mm -hmm. um, even with the one treatment. So I'm super excited um, about showing even that first before and after. All right, so we are almost done with the treatment. We finish off with this cheek. And then I'm gonna move on to the nose, the upper lip, under eye, and that's it. And of course, we're gonna go down in, in um, depth for those areas because the skin is thinner there. So Grace, um, if you would, can you kind of put your lips, show her, put her lips sure. on top of each other like that? Yeah. Like we did with the yes, exactly. yes, yes, and just stay like that. And we'll do our... And with the Granite Secret, you can also change in, um, the actual intensity of the of the treatment so over time over um more treatments we tend to increase the intensity a little as patients get used to it dr nichols is everyone a candidate for sculpture topical everyone is a candidate so all skin types all ethnicities um are actually all of them are also candidates for the granite secret mm -hmm. with um with the sculpture and also mm -hmm. the granite secret alone so mm -hmm. i mean again this is amazing to have a treatment that anybody can do um, without fear of, of side effects at all. All right, so the Granite Secret portion is over. So now I'm gonna have Cassandra pass me the Sculptra and we can kind of take off that. Yeah, just like we did. And I'll take a little of the um, gauze. Sure. And you're gonna see, basically you don't need a lot and it's gonna penetrate through these little micro channels. And then before we she leaves, it'll kind of dry up. See, just like that, isn't that amazing? How it goes in like that. And see how, look, look this is all, all we need for a face. We'll use a little bit more um, for maybe, you know, of course, larger stretch marks and such. Now, post Granite Secret with Sculpture, and even with Granite Secret alone, we don't apply any creams or anything. We let this PLLA sculpture really continue to penetrate the skin. So this is something unlike some of you who might be used to doing a laser uh, treatment or something and, and we put on all this kind of post-procedure cream or sunscreen before you leave. For this treatment, because those micro channels, we wanna keep them open and fresh, we wanna clog them with heavy creams as, these, as, as the sculpture is penetrating. We just leave the skin alone. We tell you as the patient, don't put any more uh, creams or topical products, even sunscreen on the skin for about four to six hours post-treatment mm -hmm. to really give the PLA a chance to penetrate. And Cassandra, you can, you can um, come in here and we can um, help you apply. Again, sure. this is gonna be something that stays on the skin, melts in and that she won't wash off. I really um, tell patients I would love if you just didn't wash your face for the, until the mm -hmm. next day. Some patients, of course, come early in the morning and they may have something to go to at night, which is understandable, but really sticking to that four to six hours um, is great in terms of giving the um, sculpture a chance to really penetrate. Cassandra, you can catch that, yeah. So easy. Oh, another place. So places on the face, particularly great with this treatment that um, react particularly well 
lip lines. Now, Grace doesn't really have many, but um, lip lines is a huge, huge issue for some patients. And it's tough. It's a tough thing to treat because those lines are kind of bound down. You know what I'm talking about? And so it's really hard to use just regular filler because you can still see the lines. They just look plumper, which doesn't always look appealing and can kind of give that duck look. Um, sometimes we can be very particular and improve it. But again, it's a very tough issue. And prior to this, you know, using the topical Sculptra, we weren't really seeing great improvement um, on those lip lines unless we did like a deep ablative, like our core laser, which is CO2, non-ablative CO2 laser. But that's a couple weeks of downtime because it's literally taking down, um, you know, that layer of skin. So you're super red for a couple of days, I mean, for a couple of weeks. And so it's not a treatment that everybody can do, especially it's not a treatment that most people will do in the summertime like it is here. Mm -hmm. And when you have some natural melanin in your skin, like myself and like Grace, you, you want to stay away from those deeper, deeper, deeper lasers because you can get that, that kind of post-inflammatory hyperpigmentation um, from the actual deepness of the laser itself with your own melanin reacting and causing dark marks. So again, now we have a treatment that we can use with the lip lines where we don't have to worry about that. So really, really great. So speaking of, let's have Grace close her lips again like she did. Sure. Grace, close your lips inward for me. Perfect. Good. Cassandra, I'm going to just have you rub in this last bit. Let's get real good on the lip lines. <laughs> oh, another place, under eye, dark circles. I mean, come on. <laughs> Who doesn't have this issue? It's so true. Yeah. So although I recommend always with any treatment, but um, with this treatment in particular, treating the whole face, face and neck, if you do have particular issues that you just want to focus on, such as lip lines or, or under eye, crepiness, dark circles, we can just do that. So we do do localized treatments also um, with this Greenwich Secret um, with Sculptra. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, we'll be posting this video, of course, on our NicholsMD underscore Dermatology Instagram. Uh, it'll be on our website, on our YouTube channel also. So please check it out, watch it. And if you have any questions, give us a call here, make a consultation appointment. Like I said, I think that most of you are candidates for this great, amazing treatment. Thank you.